All right, you guys, so this is the look. Yes, here's the new hair. Love it. Um, so yeah, you guys, so this is what it's looking like right now. I want to say real quickly, I do see that it is getting a little dewy after I did my hair and everything. Um, I see that it's dewy a little bit. It's not as dry. And on camera, I have to say it looks better than it is in person, though. But it's really not too bad because I'm seeing the dew, like the luminous coming through the uh, skin tint. I do recommend that before using this product, you should exfoliate or do some good skincare and moisturize. Uh, even though it says super dewy, you would think you wouldn't have to moisturize that much. You would think that you wouldn't have to do a lot because it's supposed to be dewy. But I feel like this product actually like reveal a lot that we don't want to reveal. Um, if you haven't exfoliated in a while, it'll reveal it. Um, it will gather up in dry areas of the face like I showed y'all there was areas where the foundation was like just holding on to certain areas in a sense dry patches what I'm talking about so I feel like even though it says super dewy you would think it would be so moisturizing that it would just glide on the skin you have to do some skin prep first that means exfoliate um Moisturize the skin very well. And even if you want to exfoliate by shaving the face, that's normally what I do is to shave my face until I can actually order my uh, L'Oreal, um, I think it's called a Cell Renewal uh, product. I like that exfoliation product. That's what I want to get back to is some of my original um skincare products that I used back in the day but I'm just making a point you guys with this foundation I do feel like um when you look at it you go super dewy but if you do not have your skin is not like really really like has been exfoliated you have dry patches and stuff like that I'm just saying it's not gonna look as good um but I do say and will say that it does get dewy. Look at my skin now. Like you can see the little moisture coming through and all now versus before I went to fix my hair. So just saying so you all will know that this product, you need to do good skin prep before using it. Okay. But outside of that, I do like the product. I feel like my makeup looks really really natural like i didn't go in with a cream bronzer i went with the powder bronzer and i feel like this is something like that foundation will be something good for every day and even if i do want to dress up because i feel like i'm dressed up now that i can actually create a fashion video if i really wanted to um so you can put that foundation on but you will need powder to add more coverage um such as me i have the bronzer the blush on so it gave me a little bit more coverage but i do like the finish of it but once again i will say um skin prep is very important another thing i want to say real quick is this silicone wig grip headband that i got uh y'all this is really really good i would show it to y'all but i probably show it in another video if y'all want to see it it's, it's just a wig grip band but the thing is you can use this as a headband if you're swimming running if you do yoga or any kind of sports you can use it on your natural hair whatever or your uh, whatever if you're wearing a wig whatever you can actually use it as a headband uh, however it's wonderful as a grip headband I like it this is the first time that I'm using a, a grip headband for my wig normally I, I have well back in the day I had a original headband but to me it just didn't work the silky kind it didn't work as good but this one with the grip I love the way it feels my hair feels very secure and I thought I would just mention that it feels very very secure with this on and with that I got two brushes the company actually 
give you two brushes. I don't know if this just is for like, I will use it, this one here, this spoolie for my brows, but I think you could use this light for uh, maybe doing the baby hairs or something. You could on the hair and then you get this flat uh, eye shading brush. I'm going to use it as an eyeshadow brush, but you could use this to do the concealer. You know how some people do the concealer for the part and all. I think that's why they give you these two brushes. Um, but anyways, I got two new brushes with the headband there and I thought I would mention it. And all of it was like $6.99, the two brushes and the uh, headband grip or grip headband. So what a deal. So I thought I would mention that you guys. But yeah, y'all, that is the video. I hope y'all enjoy this makeup look. Just know that there will be another one tomorrow because I will get my, oh, my favorite palette is coming tomorrow and another one of those eyeshadow palettes. That one is autumn. I think I'm getting the one in spring. It's called spring. So I'm getting that one tomorrow. So there will be another makeup look. But I think I'm going to have my face makeup already done. So it just be focusing on the eye makeup. No. No, I can't do that. Because one of the products is a face product. Which I can't wait to get. So yeah, you guys. Stay tuned for the next makeup video. And just know it will be another long video. Um, because I will talk through it. And all of that. And I might speed up certain areas. Um, you know, I don't know. We'll see. But just know that my makeup videos is long. But I want to show y'all these products. So yeah, you guys. I think I might just go ahead and do like my fashion video. I feel like I should just go ahead and do it. Like I feel like my makeup looks amazing. Like why not? I think I should go ahead and do it. Yeah. Go ahead and do it, get it over with, and be done for the day and for the for the week, basically. For the upcoming week, I will already already have my fashion video recorded. All I need to do is edit, take my time, and get it going. But anyways, you guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. And my uh, actual um, Fashion video will be on my Sheila Shemay channel, as you probably already know. So check it, out, check it out, okay? Just not the newest video will come out next week. But the one that I posted for this week is already available to watch. So if you want to check it out, go over there on my Sheila Shemay channel. Check it out. I would greatly appreciate it. Don't forget to share the video as well. And don't forget to subscribe. And yeah, you guys, much love. Thank you for watching. Take care of yourself, and I will see y'all in my next video, which will be tomorrow. So stay tuned. Much love to everyone. Many kisses. I see y'all. Love y'all. Bye-bye.